kid question, how did dinosaurs fit into the six days of creation? Ooh, this is a great question. Now, it's a little bit tricky uh, because you're going to get different answers from different Christians, right? Now, all Christians believe on uh, the core teachings of our faith, like stuff about Jesus. But on things like dinosaurs, you're going to get different answers from different people. Now, the people who dig up the dinosaur bones, right, they've been telling us for a long time that dinosaurs lived hundreds of millions of years ago. Now, some Christians agree with them. They say, yes, they are right, but there's some other Christians who think, no, dinosaurs are not even real. And then there's a third group of Christians, um, people who think the dinosaurs were real, but they think that people who found them have the timing wrong. Some people think the world's not that old, and so some people even think that people and dinosaurs were on the earth at the same time. And so you're going to get different answers from different people. Now, Christians all agree on the important stuff, like Jesus, but on things like dinosaurs, sometimes we disagree. Now, personally, for me, I am one of those people who believes that the world is hundreds of millions of years old, and I think dinosaurs existed a really long time ago, and humans came along much, much later. But let's go back to your original question. How did dinosaurs fit into the six days of creation? Well, at the beginning of the Bible, it describes creation. It tells this beautiful story about how God made the whole world and then he said that it was good. It took him six days to create all the stuff in the world and then God rested on the seventh day. He made the sun and the oceans and all the plants and animals. He even made you and me. Now, the big question is that when the Bible says day, does that mean a 24-hour cycle? Or, you know, did God create everything that exists in the universe in six 24-hour days, one human week? Or does day mean a big chunk of time, maybe even millions of years? In the Bible, when they talk about God in the Psalms, in chapter 90, it says, you, For you, a thousand years are like the passing of a day, as brief as a few night hours. So I think when God made dinosaurs hundreds of millions of years ago, that was the morning of the sixth day. And then when he made humans millions of years later, that was the afternoon of the sixth day. I know it's, it's kind of a confusing and tricky thing, and Christians have argued about it for a really long time. But here's the important part. Could God have made the entire universe in six 24-hour days? Yes. Yes, he could. Could God have made the universe over hundreds of millions of years and then called that a day in the Bible, in the poem at the beginning of the Bible? Yes, God can do anything. If you want to know for 100% certain who's right, you're going to have to wait and ask God when we get to heaven. But for today, just remember that God made everything, and he made you, and he loves you very much. And also, Dinosaurs are super cool. <laughs> we'll see you next time. Bye.